Anybody else? Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die. I am an old guy gaming, and this is Alpha 19 on build 169. We play this game on insane difficulty. The zombies are all set to nightmare speed, and we have a hell of a fun time doing it. If you guys find yourself enjoying this video, and if I entertain you, please consider hitting that like button and subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. If you have already subscribed, thank you very much. Really appreciate it. If you don't like this video, please consider leaving me a constructive comment and help me to improve. All right. So, hey, you know what we're going to do in this episode? We're going to make ourselves a motorcycle. Uh, that's what we're going to do. So uh, we found the schematic for the chassis in the last episode, and we found the handlebars on our two or three episodes prior to that. So we now have the know-how to make a motorcycle. The thing we're not going to have um, right now, though, is all the steel. So our, our first order of business in this episode is to find some steel, and we're going to have to scavenge it, uh, scavenge it for now. All right, so let's go to motorcycle. Um, so we need... We've got all of this stuff already. Well, except for the chassis and the handlebars, of course. Um, so for the chassis, we're going to need 37 forged steel, and for the handlebars, we're going to need another 7. So let's do the handlebars now, and we'll get that out of the way. I already have the wheels made. In fact, I'll tell you what, let's put all the stuff down here, um, all of this stuff that we're going to need. Now the handlebars are going to require uh, some pipes, some headlights, some mechanical parts probably, some electrical parts probably, some steel... And uh, what else? Oh, duct tape. Yeah, 15 duct tape. So let's... Oh, here we go. I made some duct tape uh, before we started the last episode. Okay. So let's get those going. Excellent. Okay. And we're going to just put all this stuff back in here for the moment. We'll keep the steel, though. So we need, um, uh, for the chassis, we need 37 in total. And we have 16. So that means we need another 21, I believe. Yeah, 21 more. So we are going to take our handy dandy impact driver and go out and get ourselves 21 more pieces of steel. Let's go. Let's do it. Everything in here is cranking at full full capacity here. We're doing more cement there. Um, making a bunch of bullets and buckshot in there. These guys are cranking out the, the, the concrete. This guy's still cranking out um, the gunpowder. Uh, and we already have... I already put... Uh, was it? Yeah, I put 3,000 in here already. Uh, so yeah, lots of industry going on here. We're probably going to get screamers like crazy, but what, so what else is new? Okay, so let's see. We need to find lampposts, and we need to find... Um, there's another junkyard nearby that has the transformers on the ground, and those usually yield some steel. If we could find a... Um, a solar panel. Sometimes you can get steel out of those, too, I think. I'm not really sure, actually, about that. But here's some lampposts here, so let's get these. I guess we haven't already cleared this place out. Oh, we've been in here. We must have just had repops. I thought I had done this place earlier. Okay, so we have 25, and so we need another 37, so we need 12 more. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's the new biker, by the way, in case you guys haven't seen him yet. Oh, the sniper rifle schematic. Yes. And what's this? Uh, fall 15 meters without taking damage. And carry, or while carrying 5,000 dudes. Okay. And a little bit of paper there. All right, cool. We found the sniper rifle. And weapons do 10% more damage when using a scope. Yes. Thank you. Okay, we'll take that. Okay, looks good. So we need seven more uh, pieces of steel. Getting there. We're getting there. There's more stuff here we could loot, but I just want to keep going after the steel. One more. And there's a lamppost right there. Okay. We now have enough steel to make ourselves 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 a motorcycle. Should we go in the electronic store? I haven't ever been in there. Tell you what. I'm gonna go back. No, I'm not. I'll make the motorcycle at the end of this episode and we'll have it for the next episode. Let's go, let's go loot this place. I have never actually been in here. Lots of dead bodies in here, man. Could come in here and get uh, get a bunch of bones. That's either a cop or Hawaii 5 0. Cop! <laughs> what the hell, man? He dropped down from up here. Sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. There's stuff in there. And we'll sell that. Mo Power Electronics. Sledgehammer parts in an electronics box. And power tools. Uh, or power tool parts, rather. Okay. Don't know that that completely makes sense, but I'm not complaining. I am not complaining. Anybody else? Let's take one of these. All right, so can we loot? Oh, we can loot this stuff. Okay. Electrical parts. I have a feeling we're going to find lots of electrical parts in this place. <laughs> um, speaker schematic. Oh, nice. Uh, you know what, though? I think we already know this. Well, no, I guess we don't know that. 
We learned the generator and the relays, but we didn't learn that, so... Okay, let's go this way. Ultimate beast ready. Yeah, that's what we learned. We found that s somewhere else. Okay. Cheap ass TVs. <laughs> What we'll do is we'll do the main floor first and then we'll we'll go uh in back. Ooh, electric timer relay, okay. I I really like that they added these new stores and stuff. Just adds more more to the game, you know. Really cool. I wonder why those can't be looted. I uh, will take those, but not really interested in the other stuff. Where is my axe? Whoops, that's not what I meant to do. Ah, more steel. Is this, this is probably just iron, right? Oh, I guess I can't even get that faucet by itself at all. Uh, is there stuff up here? There's cobblestone and boxes. I don't know if there's other stuff. Okay. All right, so we've done <clears throat> uh, the main floor. Let's go into the restrooms here really quick. Oh, wow. Sneaky. Anybody else up there? Sounds like we got the attention of some friends from the outside. How about in here? Oh, yeah. Hold still. Thank you. wonder if there's anything up here. I don't think so. Alright, let's deal with these guys. Ooh. 
Did we get a twofer on that? I think we did, but it didn't it didn't kill him. Okay. Um let's go hit the back room now. So we've got that area and this area over here. Nice. I will take those. What the hell? <laughs> Hold that head still. Ah, this is another sneaky, sneaky box. Look at that. Funny. Is this a sneaky, sneaky box? Whoa. Dude. Lots of things drop down from up above on top of you in this in this POI. All of these are like sneaky sneaky boxes, aren't they? Huh. Okay. Oh, they all they all popped out of the boxes. Okay. Any more? Are you like the security guard, sir? Just curious. That kind of hurt. Oh, there's a fat loot. So, sounds like we've got somebody in the main store here. Darlene, come here. You too, Nurse Nancy? You are now 1139 and have one skill point to spend. Hallelujah. All right, let's go back here. Come on, pop out. Oh, what What the hell? Oh, <laughs> I didn't even see you guys. Man. You know, I used to call the crawlers easy, but, and they still are, but I don't know. They, they're, they're a little more creepy now than they used to be, so maybe we call them creepy. How about that, huh? Creepy. Okay, we were looking through there before. Doesn't look like that's high enough for a Zeker to be in, unless, unless of course, you're a creepy. Okay, so we've got all this stuff, and we have no room for it. How about that? So let's go ahead and... Um, I guess we can run back out to the motorcycle first. Well, let's just see what's here first. We'll do that. And then we'll go out to the motorcycle and drop off. Weapons bag, a safe, a fat loot crate. Man, there's a lot of good stuff in here. A lot of good stuff. Okay, so let's start with the ammo pile. Okay, some shoddy shells, a little medical. No room for that. Chamois box. Okay, we've got some food that we'll use later. Ten more steel. Wow, look at that. How about that? And another steel shovel, probably not as good as ours. It is not. So that is scrap worthy for parts. And let's go ahead and put that stuff in there so we don't lose it. Okay, let's try the weapons weapons thing. Little dynamite, that's sellable, that's scrappable. We'll just put everything in this top box, and then I'll, I'll sort it out later after we're done with the episode. Um, okay, so we've got the safe left and the fat loot. Let's do the safe next. Okay, what do we have? All right, we'll sell that. And fat loots. Oh, you're locked! It's all right, we can handle it. Ooh, 
Ooh, look at that. I will take it. Um, that's not as good as ours. Plus, we have a blue um, helmet anyway, so we've got all the, you know, the mod slots for it. So, yeah, very nice. So let's compare these two really quick. I'm going to have to put a couple more things in here temporarily. We're going to take the mod off mods off of here. So we get another slot with the blue one. So here's our green and here's the blue. So the blue's just a tiny, tiny bit slower and one less range, but who cares about that on a pistol? All right. Very nice. I had uh, the auto mod on here before, but you know what? We can also make the reflex sight too, which is might be better uh, for the pistol. That was a very nice upgrade. Worth the price of admission all by itself. So, all right, cool. Guys, I think we're going to go ahead and wrap up the episode here. Um, and I'm just going to go do some inventory management to try to get all this stuff home. And when I get back to the base, I'm, I'm going to cook up the motorcycle. And then we will have a motorcycle in the next episode. And it's going to be fan freaking tastic So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.